routine court appearance in a local murder case turned into so much more. Good afternoon to you. I'm Lisa Cooney. And I'm Mark Hayes. Thanks for joining us. The guilty plea took a lot of people by surprise. WLWT News 5's Karen Johnson is live in Butler County now with reaction to the end of this high profile murder case. Karen, good afternoon. Well, good afternoon, Mark. Yes, in less than two weeks after the murder of Carol Boyd of Fairfield, the suspect in this case pleaded guilty this morning to aggravated murder. 29 year old Michael uh, Miller was just indicted yesterday, and today, immediately following his arraignment, he admitted to killing Boyd, a mother of two and grandmother of eight. The murder took place inside her Fairfield apartment. Prosecutors say Miller and Boyd knew each other from a local bingo hall. They say he knew she was taking. Oxycodone for a recent hip surgery, and that's what he was after. Today, Prosecutor Mike Moser described the killing as brutal, saying Miller first hit Boyd over the head with a dumbbell, crushing her skull. He then proceeded to slit her wrist to try and make it look like a suicide. Well, today, Miller admitted to the facts of the case, pleaded guilty to aggravated murder in exchange for Moser taking the death penalty off of the table. Boyd's daughter spoke, uh, supported this decision, and spoke to us about her mother after today's hearing. My mom was an amazing woman. Um, she was very kind. She didn't know a stranger. She was very giving. She would give her last um, to help anybody in need. Um, she was church going. She just, she loved her family. Her family came first. And Boyd's family says that family had a trip to Disney plan, something she won't be able to go on now. As for Miller, he was also sentenced today, and he was sentenced to life in prison without the possibility of parole. Reporting live in Hamilton, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.